So one of the most frustrating parts about being a young adult in the transition process is hearing all of these words and acronyms when you may not know what they mean. IEP, SDI, baseline, hitting your goal over three consecutive probes. What's a probe? Right, this can be so confusing and make your head completely spin, trying to understand what's going on and keep up with the pace. But remember, an IEP meeting is about you, and especially if we're in the transition process, this is entirely revolving around your skills to build for after high school. So if something doesn't make sense to you, pause the meeting, ask for clarification. It's important that you understand everything that's being discussed so that you're able to have an active role in your transition process. But there's also other things that can be mentioned at an IEP transition meeting or any IEP meeting that might not make sense to you. And these can be acronyms for agencies. Agency, right? The title of this video. So have you ever heard of things like OVR, the SIL, the ARC, the agency that I work for? So these agencies all have different programs and services that can help a student in the transition process or IEP process overall. So for example, OVR is the Office of Vocational Rehabilitation. They focus on employment. The SIL is the Center for Independent Living. They focus on independent living skills. And the ARC focuses on advocacy and inclusion. All of these agencies can have a key role in helping your transition planning process to be the most successful that it can be for your future. So do you know what agencies are involved in your IEP meeting or involved in your school? We'd love to hear about them. Hit us up on Insta, Facebook, and Twitter, and tell us what agencies are involved in your meetings or at your school and how you've interacted with them.